Okay, next on this WordPress tutorial, I'm going to actually add a tab up here. And I'm going to fix up this sidebar so it looks much better than it does now. So let's get at it. Let's add a tab. Let's log into the WordPress the dashboard. Okay, we're in here. Let's go to Add Page. Add New. Let's call it WordPress Step by Step. Let's label it as number four. Now let's publish it. Let's come back to here and refresh. And this should show up right here. There we are, step by step. Let's actually add a tab underneath this tab just to see how it's done. Call it step one. So how we do that is add new. And call it step one, uploading WordPress. Let's come down here. Let's order it as number one. And the parent for this one is going to be WordPress step by step. Now we publish it. Let's take this back to the dashboard. And when we click home now, when we mouse over the WordPress step by step, it should show up underneath this, but it doesn't, but it is here, if that makes sense to you. The page that we just made is a tab underneath this, but it's hidden to the public. And I will explain that in a future video tutorial. Okay, now let's go fix up this sidebar. But first, let's fix up the Facebook and the Twitter follow. As you can see down on the left hand side at the bottom, this is the theme picks. This is not my Twitter or not my Facebook. And this will apply to the World Web Options theme only. This will apply only to this theme. So how do we do that? We come over here, we go to Appearance, World Web Options, click on it. Now we scroll down, and Facebook.com right here, we add our Facebook URL. And that's mine, Facebook.com slash John Jarvis Coaching. And Twitter, same thing. Mine is twitter.com slash John Jarvis 22. Another thing we're going to do is get rid of these things right here. These are so out of here. And what that's going to do is pull this video up because I already have a video recorded that's supposed to be right here. So let's do this. Okay, I'll show you how far down this is. Scroll down really slowly. Right here, these two URLs are right here and that's something about Google their new algorithms say no advertising above the fold which is from this level here up they want no advertisements here at all so we go back just simply delete these scroll down click save changes now we come back here and refresh the video is moved up not the right video mind you that is where my video is going now let's get rid of all of this and how we do that is simply come back here appearance widgets bring all of these by left clicking and holding and drag them over here let's bring them all over to the left Now right up in here, we're going to add text because your text is where your autoresponder is going to be going. So let's scroll down and find our text. Right here. Left click again, drag it right up to this box. 
And here I'm going to put free PDIMI newsletter. And I'm going to grab my HTML code and paste it right here. Paste. Save. Close. Come back here. Refresh. Now, if people want the free newsletter for PDIMI, which is Personal Development Internet Marketing Institute, first name, last name, and email. I think one more thing I might do here is actually add the Fidget widget. How we do that now? Come back over here. Left click on Fidget widget that we installed in an earlier tutorial. Hold it in and drag it over, put it underneath text. Click save close. Let's go back to dashboard for now. Back here. Refresh. And the Fidget widget. It tells you again where your traffic is coming from. And if you click here and open it up. You can see our traffic is coming from all over the world pretty much so far and yes even Google anyway let's go back to the dashboard and that is long enough for this video when I come back what I'm going to do is add my video right here alright bye for now